I didn't expect it to look like that. What are we doing today anyway? Uh, we are, if you notice here, I got some new headlights that are retrofitted with projectors. Oh yeah? Retrofit? Yep. Cool, man. But this one here is broken. Okay. Oh yeah. So, hmm. I have my stock headlights and I'm going to separate the lenses and swap over my stock lenses onto these. Okay. So that way it's not broken. Yeah. I like the idea. Yeah. We can take this and we can make it new again. Yep. All right, man. Sounds like a plan. Got our headlights. Yeah. All right. We're going to take our lenses off. All right. We've got these other lenses over here. Yep. I took these off my stock headlights. Mm -hmm. I need to sand them down and re-clear re them so they're not foggy anymore, but yeah, I'm gonna do that at work. Hey, Ryan's gonna fix these ones up. One of the first episodes that we ever released is how to black out and modify the G35's headlights. And in that episode, I actually used the heat gun method to go around the outside and then remove the lens. But it's been like, it's been four years. And the modification world for headlights has gone through the roof. So we know now <laughs> that if you want to remove these lenses, how do we do it now, Ryan? You just stick them in your oven at home. In your oven? Yep, in your oven. All right, so we have the oven. Phew. That's why we are in the kitchen. Yep. And uh, what temperature do we need to run it at? I uh, did a bunch of research and I came up with a safe number of about 200 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay, that sounds like the number that I told people that the adhesive would heat up, so we we're right on that, that's good. Yep, and then actually when I did the, the stock headlights the other night, I did it for 14 minutes. So 200 degrees at 14 minutes and it was perfect. All right, and uh, how are we gonna get this to not melt, right? Because plastic in an oven, metal, you know. Yeah, you don't want to put it directly on the grates. So I have set up already in here. You want to put it all the way on the bottom grate so that way it can fit. And mm. then grab a piece of wood, mm -hmm. which I'm going to use, or I've seen people do it with a baking tray and the baking paper. Okay. I don't have any of that, so that's yeah. why I'm using the wood. But uh, Wood is going to be way safer. Yeah. Yeah. And don't worry, it won't catch on fire. It's only 200 degrees. So. Yeah. So we will then preheat this to 200. Yep. Right? While that's preheating, you can come over to your headlight, check it to see if there's any screws that hold it together in addition to the glue. So this particular headlight has a screw there. Yeah. A screw there and a screw there. Okay. And I believe that's all the screws it has. And okay. you also want to remove any bulbs that might be in it. Mm-hmm. Just for safety so you don't break any of the bulbs or hurt those even though the headlight itself gets hotter than 200 degrees when it's on but yeah better just safe than sorry better don't safe than sorry bulb. for sure yeah cool so yep just take those screws off remove bulbs and then stick it in when you're done all right and then 14 minutes yep 14 minutes cool I'll just show them how it's done This is in there. I can't take that out until I get it separated. That was fast. <laughs> I'm not ready yet, Alright. Good to go. Just that way once it's done, you can go straight to taking it apart. You don't gotta mess with any of that, letting it cool down. Mm -hmm. You want it to be hot. Makes sense to me. Yep. Grab your oven mitt so you don't burn your hand. Yep, safety first. Ryan is remembering gloves. <laughs> oh, I only have one. <laughs> and be careful about touching the sides and the edges. Any metal to plastic contact is going to be bad. Yeah. All right. That's good. Yep. Cool. And Set the timer. Again, it's 200 for 14 minutes. Yep. Yep. And then go do something, clean your house or whatever you gotta do. Yeah. Alright. 
You know what I did while we were waiting? What'd you do? I bought more car parts. No, you didn't. <laughs> <laughs> Is that it? For the Mazda? Yep. Awesome. Cheers. So there's one thing you could do while waiting, buy more car parts. Yeah, right? <laughs> so, I'm gonna leave the oven on because I'm gonna put the other headlight in while we take this one apart. Yeah, that makes sense. All right. I really should have another one of these, but. Got Chef Ramsey over here. Threw it back. All right. It's a little toasty. Put the other headlight in there while we take this one apart. Good to go. Yep. Super hot now. Oh yeah. And uh, how are we taking this apart? Well, you have tabs all the way around. All right. So the, the lens has a little plastic tab, nipple thing, whatever. And then this black tab goes over top of it, yeah. which holds it in. So there's another one right here. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So we don't want this to cool down too much, nope. but we've got some tools here. We've got a little pry tool, we've got a little screwdriver, yep. and a uh, plastic stick. Yep. Flathead. So I'm going to try the plastic stick first, just so it is the safest option. All right. Once it's heated up, these are pretty easily flexible, so you can just use your finger and then just get in there. Gun. Yeah, this is so much easier. Like, with if you were hitting it with a heat gun, you'd have to worry about flexing and stuff happening right now. But because it's all even, yeah. I mean, these have been taken apart before, so it's possible that whatever adhesive was used is not as strong as the stock adhesive. Yeah, possibly. So that could be helping me out some, but. is off. There's a few on the bottom. Getting all sticky. Mm -hmm. You might get a little sticky. All right. All right. Look at that. Got a marshmallow. Yeah. Cool. All right. Now we've got the uh, housing and the lens separated. Yep. And if you made it this far, you liked the video, so make sure to smash that like button down below. Make sure to subscribe and share with all your friends. We got lots more coming up. Ryan already ordered more parts for the Mazda. So we got that coming up and we got lots more. So stay tuned. Yep. Yeah. Awesome job. Dude. Woo! Woo! <laughs> cool. Thanks for watching this episode of Mills Garage. Make sure to like and comment below and share the video. And we'll see you next time. Yep. Check the December thing up. Oh yeah, uh, also uh, 2015. I kept it because it's got drinking games on it. Just because of the drinking games? Yeah. Voila! Bam! Oh, that's Patrick. Patrick. Yep. Yeah. 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 Yeah.